Welcome back. In order to create a KPI in Tableau, you need a good understanding of calculated fields. Without a solid grasp of this, it would be difficult to put together KPIs you need. It would be a constant struggle, so make sure you really understand calculated fields. You learned about calculated fields in detail in a previous course, so this is a review rather than a step-by-step -step primer. After this lesson, you will be able to put together a simple KPI visualization in Tableau. We are going to be taking the point of view of being a data analyst in a marketing and sales unit. We'll use the Sales Superstore data set that you should be very, very familiar with by now. We'll make a KPI that shows sales by category and region. The KPI will have a green check mark if sales are above 125,000 US dollars and a red X if it's below 125,000 US dollars. And if you have a different currency, it doesn't matter. I, you could just set the threshold wherever you feel is appropriate, but I'm using 125,000 US dollars. If you don't already have it open, please open up the Sales Superstore dataset. Look for a category and drag it to the row shelf. Look for region and drag it to the column shelf. Look for sales, it's down in the measures area, and drop it on text in the marks card. Your screen should look something like mine. Now we're going to set up the simple KPI. Right click on sales down in the measures area, then select create calculated field like I'm doing here. When the calculated field window pops up, type in KPI where you see Calculation 1. In the formula section, type in what I'm typing in here, but I'm going to say it also. If sum, open parentheses, sales, close parentheses, is greater than 125,000, then open quotes above benchmark, close quotes, else below benchmark, within quotes, end. Then click OK. Now go to the marks card and select shape, as I'm doing here. The sheet will look a little funky for a second, but it doesn't matter, we'll fix that. Click on Shape in the Marks area. That will open the Edit Shape box. Click on the Select Shape Palette arrow there and select KPI. So do the following in the order that I'm describing. The order is important because of the way in which Tableau set this up. So first click on Above Benchmark, then select the green check mark and then it should change that above benchmark to a green check mark. Do the same for below benchmark and the red X. Now click OK. Go to the label, text, and then clear the show mark label checkbox and click OK. There you go. Click on the bottom and rename the sheet as Sales KPI. And we're going to continue with this exact setup in the very next lesson. So just you should go to the next lesson and keep, keep this running in, in your uh, computer so that you don't have to uh, restart everything.